Hey guys, I hope that you're all doing well. Welcome back. Let's play some more CK3. We are Alfonso, the father of Spain. And uh, we are at war with France, and uh, they've kind of kicked my teeth in a few times, so... I'm going to assume... Oh, no, I did not mean to do that. I'm assuming that... Uh, uh, what's his name? Conrad? Is that his name? No. Heinrich. Heinrich the Foolish. I'm assuming he's got this under control. I uh, really cannot be bothered to fight any more French because they are... They stop me every time. <laughs> so... I'm uh, going to invest more of my monies into uh, having some stronger... Stronger levies. So, some... Or not levies, but uh, men-at-arms. So, some more of these guys would probably be for the best. And, um... That's probably fine. So, we finished one of our buildings over here. Uh, titles can be created. We can declare war. Children lack guardians. Ah, uh, yeah. My son and heir lacks a guardian. Well, he certainly could use a good one. Um, ambitious Midas touched hunter. Might as well be Zemena. She's Basque, so I definitely don't want him to convert culture. That would be no good. We want him to remain our culture. To be honest with you, our people consider us of a foreign culture, which is strange, but uh, that's okay. So as you can see here, if we go to our cultural map mode, Australianese, we are Castilian. Um, you can see here, Galicia is controlled. He's Galician, but he's Australianese. <laughs> I am Castilian, and these guys are pretty much all Castilian, I believe. Now he's Castilian. What about you? He's Castilian. So they're, you know, it's looking okay, but... So let's take a look here. Where am I at as far as my contribution here? 80%? That does not sound right. It's going down a bit. Does it not consider him? So this is like contribution by his allies, I assume? I might be wrong. And I've been thinking it might make sense to move our uh, webcam down here in this corner so that way it wouldn't cover up over here. It would just be kind of like right here. I don't know. We're still working on it. We're still. Th Let me know in the comments below what you think about that because I want to make sure we are, uh, you know, making things look pretty. And when I spent, uh, spent money on this nice camera so you guys can see my below average face. I don't care about the counts. It says they're powerful, but they're not actually. So... He's... got his men, but uh... I think it's about time we head back in and start sieging him down a bit. Matilda. Tuscan claim for the county of Verona. Uh, yeah, I can help out with that. I Seems like another one of those wars that they're... Declaring for kind of no reason. So do we have our knights? We have our knights. The quality is so bad, though. Like, that's a problem, guys. That's a big problem. So he took the war goal. Yowzers. This war is just like an absolute slog fest. So how many men does he have right here? Almost five grand? Yeah, they're coming for me, so I'm going to have to... So basically, I'm just over here to distract. If I can take this in four months, that would be great. And that would let him have time to siege stuff back. They grow up fast. My daughter is now a uh, charismatic negotiator. And she can... Uh, she's betrothed to the son of Duchess Matilda. Very good. So... Now, if we can win this, that would be all the better. I'm not so sure. Looks like... Uh, yeah. Okay, let's get out of here. My hook on him has expired. That's fine. If you guys want to come on up here and attack me in the mountains, you can. I don't mind, particularly. And they'll take that back eventually, and 
This is just all a big mess, honestly. So you got Venezia. Serene Doge. Very cool. My wife is pregnant again? Are you kidding me? You are 45 years old. You are actually 45 years old. Oh, this is so bad. I thought I was safe. Turns out I'm not. Where's he at? I really just need to be distraction. That's all I'm trying to do, is just be a distraction. And allow him to siege his stuff back. We'll see how that goes. Toulouse is down here. Duchess Uraka. Hmm. Not so sure. I could start pressing some claims. Let's get some claims over here. We've got the money. So, I'm not sure where he's at here. So he's over there beating up on Matilda's. So they're just leaving? This doesn't sound right. What are they doing? Wait, what are you doing? Why are you running away? <gasps> you fool. He could have won that. Could have won that. Yeah, I'm done. I'm not spending any more of my time on these fights. These are a waste of my time entirely. Whatever, man. So, let's see here. Had another son. Gotta be kidding me. So that means I will lose literally so much stuff when I die. That being said... Craven? Really? Hmm. That's no good. Let's see here. So he's 11. Kingdom of England. Well, that would make a good betrothal. Let's do that. Oh, hey, nice. Looks like Nuno has been hard at work down here. Incorporating some of the land for the father, the holy land. The land for the, for our God. I don't know what I'm trying to say over here. All right. So he is craven and lazy and zealous. Interesting. King Robert Kurtow, Kurtos. So it looks like the HRE is losing all these fights. And uh, I honestly can't really be bothered to help out anymore. Kind of getting annoyed at all this garbage. Look how weird that crown on his head looks. That, look, that looks funny, doesn't it? Heinrich III. Hmm. All right. I'm, uh... Hmm. I just want out of these wars. I mean, it's not a huge deal because it's like I'm not... I'm not really losing anything from being in them. But dang, man. Empty council position, so we could get a new steward. He wants to count a seat on the council. But I can get more money if I have him. So, we'll go with more money. More money is good. As far as crown authority goes... This is fine. My hook on him has expired. Looks like we're getting up there in age. We're almost 50 now. This is unfortunate, though. Disinherit him. Oh. That's all I had to do? Oh. Hmm. Well, I think that's gonna make him absolutely hate my son Alfonso, but... Better him than me. Leof... Leofwine of Godwin. Interesting. So, if he were to ever... This is very interesting. So, I have a courtier. Where is he at? 
Um, not vassals. Change. Male only equal. Hmm. So three of my guys approve. I can't change this though. You have one or more vassal with negative opinion of you. Well, let's see here. Can I sway you? I will. That's fine with me. I, my vassal should like me anyways. Sevian conquest. Oh wow, we are really growing over here. Who is this? Galicia, huh? Sevian conquest of the Sheikdom of Barajos. He's attacking me. Okay. Where's his capital? Right here. Let's head on down there and beat up on him then. This is fine. He doesn't have any men, hardly. So, should be a pretty easy whooping. A war profiteer. Republican ruler. Maintenance per dread. I like that. Let's just go with more money while at war. You gotta pay for the army somehow, right? Let's get these guys down there. They shouldn't be winning that in the meantime. We should be okay. There we go. Early battle phase. So we do need to get some horsemen by the looks of it. Some horsemen men at arms would be great. So we've actually captured the Emir. I'm gonna go ahead and ransom him because I am not at all concerned about this war being a hard war to win. Like we just gained, I think it was 250 for that. So it's very much worth it. Because we're not actually even losing money while being in the war, so we're good. Nice, get the unpressed claim, or... This is fine. I definitely need to get my, um, my quality of my troops up a bit. That's definitely an issue that we have. Medellin. Well, Medellin. Medellin is uh, the city that Pablo Escobar was from, so... Increased troop levy. Building construction cost. Ooh. Construction and piety cost. Or increased levy. Let's just go with the increased levy. We've got a lot of war going on right now. This is nice though. My vassals have taken basically all of this down here. Oh my. Getting messages over here. Apologies. Let me uh, exit out of that real quick. We have lost the war led by Emperor Heinrich. Yeah, it's fine. I don't care. Shouldn't affect me too negatively. Let's win this guy here. There we go. Get those guys out of there. And uh, we can... Ransom a couple prisoners. Wow. You are... Who? Why are you worth so much money? Unimportant courtier. I don't know. Well, let's get up here and wipe these guys out. Hopefully before they do that. I've gained a favor hook. Very cool. So, where is Badajoz? Where is that? Oh, they do have it, actually. So let's see if we can catch these guys and fight them. Looks like we can. So, my war contribution. So I gained prestige even though we lost, by the looks of it. All right. All right, well. I said that he was a drunkard, and that was probably why he declared that war, but then he continued to uh, actually clap the cheeks of the Holy Roman Empire, so... Who's the fool? <laughs> Cousin slain in battle. Okay. Let's see here. Let's 
guy's been in prison. Why is it asking for so much money? Who are you? He's an evil lackey, so he's unimportant. Hmm. Well, we're gonna need to take this, so we'll just hang out here. And then once he starts making some progress on his capital, we'll go back down and beat up on him again. So, we'll be good. Should be fine. I don't know what he's doing, honestly. So it looks like there's some walls somewhere. Not sure what it means by partial, if he has the only one with walls in it, but that's okay. So we're gonna do that. Oh, he left. Oh, it looks like he's getting beat up on by somebody else now. Margaret comes of age. Very good. We have swayed him. We now control Badajoz. And let's head on down and just start, you know, occupying his land. Because, you know, that's kind of what we got to do here. Let's see if we can kill those guys there, because, you know. Did we capture him again? You have the money? No, you don't. Alright, well, let's just enforce that demand. 103 ducats is great. Um, we will gain prestige, 150 prestige as well. All for a war that had nothing to do with me. And in this game, you can actually disband your armies in hostile territory, and it doesn't affect you negatively, unlike CK2, where you needed to disinherit them for your friends. Or in your in your friendly territory, I mean. Can imprison criminals? No, Infanta Sanchez. Sancha. Is there a reason why? Christina? Really? Well, let's see here. Who's in this? You, my friend, shall be swayed. I need you to like me. Okay. So, we're getting up there in age. And it looks like our son, Alfonso, is doing... Okay, he's humble. He's greedy. That won't help diplomacy, but it will help money. So, which is all fine and dandy. Um, looks like we can actually construct a new holding. And they're 700. So we're going to... Oh, it's actually 600. So we're going to do that. Oh, because it's in Leon. Very nice. And get our capital duchy building as well. I'm not sure exactly how that works, but we'll see what we can do here. And we can also declare war on them. For that county over there. So we're actually going to... We're going to do it. It's fine. Looks like the control over here is very low. Let's send our um, our guy to do that, and then we'll declare this war here. Raise the army. We'll send them over to go siege down. Uh, Yida? I don't know how to pronounce that. Should be a very easy war, though. Just need to be mindful of where we're going to attack. That's all. We definitely are going to be spending some money to get some more man at arms in our ranks. Probably going to get light, rid of these light footmen. Oh, really? Okay. So you are a uh, cadet branch of my family. Interesting. Okay, so. Interesting. So it's going to take another seven years to get that uh, all the way up, which is kind of kind of crazy. But so she is of age, and uh, she's defending County of Urgel. That's fine. Judith van Vlanderen <laughs> has a claim on the Duchy of Flanders, which is up here. This probably has to be a weak claim, but we'll take a look here. Let's see here. Do we have any prisoners worth ransoming? 
you can go, but you have to convert. You can also go, but you must convert. You can go, but you are already Catholic. So, but you must join my... No. But I'll gain a hook on you. That's fine. Need to clean out our prison. Gain a couple of hooks. That's fine. Never know when they could be super useful, so... So let's just, uh, get this one done. And actually, in the meantime... We're going to... Destroy that regiment, because we don't need them. And instead, we are going to upgrade you guys here. And that will... Get you guys raised, and we'll actually... Increase your size to a size 2 next month. There we go. And so, they're going to make their way over and they'll help out with some of our sieges. The Lollard heretics. Once we take his capital, get a couple more prisoners. Don't need you. 105. He is an unlanded random person, so I don't know why I'm getting so much money for these prisoners, but I will take it very gladly. Focus reading, so I gain... Ooh, I'll take the prestige. That's good, that'll help me. Being faithful will give us clergy opinion. It's pretty nice. Nice. Free money. Ooh, Andalusian Mawadi populists, interesting. We got a pretty large chunk of men down there as well. Hmm. Let's wrap this war up over here. Don't have a whole lot of choice. So we need to avoid this big stack here, especially with our uh, primarily levies. Another thing here. Okay. All right. Yeah, we definitely need to get this siege over with very soon. They're making good progress over here. So we're at 0.14, and I'll check this out. We're going from 1.4 up to 2.4. It's very good. That's a that's a big bonus, right? The issue is is that these guys are going to start sieging stuff down. It's going to be quite annoying. So we need to, we're going to need to siege this down and then we'll be able to peace out, but not until then. Let's hope that this goes quickly. I think once we take that we should be good. There we go. No prisoners or anything either, so enforce our demands. And uh, immediately head on down to go take out these, these rebels down here. It's a little nerve-wracking, but they're on- they're all, uh, low, um, quality, so... Should be okay. We'll see. As soon as we kill them, we should be good. They've definitely sieged down a bit of land, though. Alfonso comes of age. He's a charismatic negotiator. Very good! So it turns out that being craven, or being greedy, is not gonna end up being much of a big deal. That's great. Hopefully they are not going to be reinforcing. They are. Hmm. Oh my gosh. Yeah, that's bad. Yeah, that's bad. Okay, let's flee. Oh, that's annoying. Empty counselor position. So, let's get you over here. And then... Wow, we lost everybody in that one. Duchess Loba Nunez. Okay, well, you can definitely be there and then I'm gonna need a better marshal so we're gonna get you over there and then we're gonna end up mar marching down there so mercenaries control protecting against factions that's all fine and dandy oh uh, my daughter has died really childbirth ah that is stressful actually 
So let's get down here and uh, get those guys off of that that fort down here. Defending a river crossing. Yeah, I'd rather you didn't. Let's see here. Good, they broke that siege, which is good. That was kind of my goal. Looks like we can turn this one. This is fine. Our our knight was killed. Wow. There we go. So be it. Now, you, you can be ransomed. You're going to pay for it, but you can be ransomed. And uh, you're going to get out, and you're going to pay up for it. So that's all fine and dandy. Cool. That will do it for this one. We definitely consolidated a bit of land over here. We're going to continue to uh, make these happen here. So he's allied to who? The Byzantines, really. Huh. We'll figure that one out in the next one. I hope you guys did enjoy. Please show your support and leave a like on the video. And don't forget to subscribe. Check out the Discord as well as the Patreon if you want to support the channel. Or if you want to check out any of our cool merch we have. All of that's linked below. With all that being said, this is Chewy Shoot, and I'll catch you guys later. A huge special thanks to my top supporters on Patreon, Bloodbound92, Palmer, Jack Thompson, Drunk Binary, Some Kind of Meme, Valentel, Jaren Clampett, Corbett Gaming, Home TV, RJ Pilot, Callus Cassowary, The Bitter Steel, and many more. I appreciate you guys very much. Don't forget to check out the videos linked on the left and the right, and don't forget to subscribe.